We gotta hit him. No! Oh my god, we actually hit him! Hello everyone and welcome back to Call of the Wild. There's no way I hit him. That was a crazy shot. Where was it? And it was a vital? That is... <laughs> that was an awesome shot, guys. Yeah, so this is uh, this is Rancho Del Arroyo. I just picked it up. And I have to say, this might be one of my favorite maps. I love the animals here. I love the scenery. There are, there are cacti on this map. I mean, who doesn't love cacti? So seriously, that's like cacti and succulents are my favorite plants ever. So as soon as I found out, guys, I was obsessed with this map. But yeah, this is my first look on it. And this is our first guy right here. Let's see. Was he anything good? I think he was just a level three. So nothing too special, but wow. And that was <laughs> that was awesome all right let's see he was oh what a shot guys just barely so he's only a silver but man that's awesome so on the bottom right guys um we can't taxidermy because if you look we only have a thousand dollars so this kill was very much needed now we have a little bit more but uh in case we run across a diamond today we definitely need to get those numbers up because we are really low on funds all right, where are we? So there's a lake down there. That might not be a bad idea to check out. But it's pretty late in the day. But we also don't have much money to reset the time. What the hell? <laughs> that is so creepy. Um, so in our inventory here, in our lures, what do we have? Scent eliminator, turkey collar. Ah, there we go. Predator, jackrabbit collar. Let's call her in and see if we can get her. We got some turkeys around here too. She doesn't really seem to care about our food, uh, <laughs> our food call essentially. Maybe she's too horny to eat. I know how that feels. Ooh, warning call coyote. All right, so we do have coyotes in this area. They may have been attracted by the call, which is hmm, kind of problematic because they're going to be really hard to hit, especially if they spook this easy. Where are they though? They might just be on the other side of this here, but god damn, this vegetation is thick. Oh, here we go. Coyote. Did we get him? Oh, I think we got him. Holy shit. How lucky was that? What? Oh no, that wasn't a coyote. That was a bobcat. Holy crap. Whoa, whoa, whoa. What just, uh... What just happened there? Might have been a turkey going overhead. Holy crap, guys. That was so unexpected. All right, let's grab her. I mean, she's only level two, but that was my first Mexican bobcat. And what a shot. That was iron sights from 13 yards away. Holy crap. All right, how much did they go for? 1,000. All right, we're slowly starting to get our money back. Man, this is going really well. Let's get a little bit of high ground. That might give us a little. Yep. That might give us a little bit of an edge on these guys. Let's see. Where are you? Again, so dense here. Even if I was able to spot them. Ooh. Ooh, mule deer. She's 200 something. Okay, so we're fine. There we go. Now that is better. Level two. But we can definitely drop him from here. But he's nervous though. Ooh, we better double check. How far he is. Yeah, he's about 195 away. I say we drop him. Pull out the Empress here. Just give him a little bit of a love tap. There we go. Well, we hit him. But I might have missed his lung actually. I might have aimed a little bit too high. Hopefully there's only two of them though, because if I messed up and there's a diamond in that herd <laughs> and I just shot a level two, ooh, that is that is gonna be bad. But we should be able to find out from this uh this zone here. Shit guys, I just realized it. I don't have Pablo with me. I put him away. Next time we go back to the uh to the cabin, we gotta pull him out. Where the hell were these deer? Were they over here? Yeah, I think they were over here. Man, they were really far away. Oh, oh no. What? No organs hit? Are you kidding me? That's kind of disappointing. But we hit him with the Empress though, so if he he might actually go down still. 
because even though it wasn't an organ that is a beast of a gun and he's only a level four or sorry only a class four man i'd love if he was a level four well maybe not with this shot actually <laughs> but i probably would have aimed a little bit uh, a little bit better if he was a four Ooh, level three pronghorn all right all right how far away about 200 i think we can hit this one a little bit better than our last one eh pretty sure we can we can do something here there we go that was a hit and let's mark it he was right about there so we'll go after him later where did our blood trail go 25 to 50 Oh, actually, maybe sticking to the roads. Oh, okay, okay. White tail deer. Oh, yeah, that's definitely. I thought that might have been the mule deer, but that's something different. Okay. Let's stay calm. Let it chill. Ooh, they must be really close. Put on some scent spray. So I, I can't see anything over in there. So I don't know how close that. Oh, here we go. Whitetail, nervous, traveling. Where's our buck? Let's switch over to these. A little bit easier. Yeah, she's still traveling. Here we go. Here we go. That's nice. Nice level two. And we're going to blast him. Oh, no. Well, we hit him, uh, but I didn't expect him to run so quickly after whistling. Oops. So <laughs> that was not good. So we got another animal to go after. Oh, there we go. Now that one was a good hit. Okay. Now we've got three animals to go after. Or is it four? I don't know. Let's track down this, uh, this muley here. Wait, white tail. Wait, what? Bleed rate, very low. Okay. And we were hunting mule deer before, right? And now it's a white-tailed deer. Or am I just stupid? <laughs> were they actually white-tailed the whole time and I didn't realize it? That honestly could have been the case. All right, so we got one of them here. Yeah, it was a white-tail the whole time. <laughs> I thought it was a mule deer. Oh, no way. Did it really not penetrate to the... So we did have a good shot, guys, and it would have hit the lung. It just didn't penetrate enough. That's bullshit. A polymer tip and it didn't penetrate. Oh, it's because we hit him in the neck and then I had to shoot all the way through. And what do we go for now? Do we go for the pronghorn or do we go after these other two whitetail? Oh, damn it. I guess we go for these whitetail and then we circle back for the pronghorn. So, oh, here we go. Yep, no organ sit. Fresh. And I'm thinking we hit him again, right? It looks like we didn't. And we hit him with a gun that might not kill him. Man, he's still 75 to 100. I don't think we're going to drop this whitetail. I think we didn't use the right gun. All right. Who's, who's calling? Who's talking shit? That's him. That's him. 25 to 50. He didn't go down. That's okay. Because we got a second chance and we're not going to lose it this time. Did I hit him? Guys, I don't think I hit him. Well, that was most definitely him. So let's run over there. How did I mess that up again? He must have been... Oh, you know why? We were up high. So I didn't account for that when I was shooting. I thought, okay, he's a decent enough distance. I need to aim a little bit high. You don't need to aim high if you're up uh, higher in elevation. I should have aimed right in the center. Damn, rookie mistake. Oh, here we go. Ooh, level. Is that him? Oh, that's him. Do we go for these guys? Or do we finish off what we started? Guys, I think we need to finish off what we started. Where is he? Right there. No, that's a different one. That is a different one altogether. Huh. Okay, this area is kind of loaded then. 
you know what? I say we leave these whitetail alone and we go after that level four pronghorn. I don't think he's diamond potential, but we're going to take him out and he's probably going to be a really nice gold. Oh, look at him. Beautiful. Actually, guys, he is only 150 away. So we can hit that for sure. I should be able to hit a lung from here too. There we go. That seemed like a good shot. Let's follow him. Where is he? He's not down yet. That's a problem. Oh, there's a bird. <laughs> oh, who are you? Was that our deer? No way. Was that our deer? 25. That's our deer. 25 to 50. God damn it. I didn't think he was with them. There's a 220. There's a few good deer there, but <laughs> our 25 to 50 was there. Ah, oh, shit. Holy crap. That is a lot of whitetail. None of them are good, though. All right. So we're going to come down here. We're going to grab this pronghorn. No matter what we see, unless it's a diamond, we're going to go back, grab that other pronghorn and look and see if we ended up shooting that doe and dropping her. Because, man, oh, man, are we getting sidetracked. So we saw them somewhere down in here. That looks like their need zone right there. So where was the blood? Hope it's a vital. I'm not seeing any big patches. I might have messed him up. Oh, here we go. Nope, we got a vital. Let's go. Awesome. So I think we got a really nice gold on our hands, guys. Oh, sh oh my God, it was a cactus. <laughs> I thought I was getting attacked by something. So he, yeah, he's dropping pretty quick. He should be not too far away. We're going to let that buck go. You know what? He deserves it at this point. There's, <laughs> I would almost feel bad killing him now. He's, he's tried so hard to survive. Here we go. Blood right here. So I just, I just wouldn't feel right if I took him out. Oh, hey buddy. Wait a second. I actually, I have my shotgun loaded with birdshot. There we go. So, uh, by the way, guys, I lied. Um, we're also going to take out birds if we see them too. I don't think it was a diamond bird, but you know what? We might be surprised when we go check. Where the hell did the blood go? I already lost the blood trail. Yeah, a little bit more blood here. Man, this would be a lot easier with Pablo. I really wish I had him with me. Oh, um. Hi. You can, you can go. I, well, all right. I mean, I just kind of feel bad. I, I don't I don't know what to do. <laughs> there we go. We got another one. Guys, I feel so, <laughs> what is going on on this map? This is a very interesting map. And before we grab him, I just want to see, is there anything down here? It's a very open area. Yeah, there's no animals in there. Ooh, that would be really cool to look through, though. Ooh. Oh, my God. I love this map so much. All right, let's grab him. And he's a gold. Damn, he's a he's a pretty nice gold. And look at that, guys. I knew I could hit him right in the lung. Good penetration. And that's $1,000. And she should be, what, 600 something? 600. Oh, right on the money, guys. Right on the money. And we have a bird over here. That should go for about 1,000. Man, we're really earning money back quick. Now, where'd this bird drop? Right there. Okay. Let's see. Are you anything special? I don't think so. Nope, just a gold, but wow, look at that. That is awesome. <laughs> that is really cool. So actually, I just looked it up and this is an uncommon fur type. So uh, I think we're going to keep it. Oh, just one, <laughs> just one pellet in between the wings that should not have hit it. And we got it. So yeah, a nice gold with an uncommon color. We're going to save this. We're not going to taxidermy it yet, but we're going to save it. Okay, there we go. 942 so let's head back we've got a pronghorn and possibly another doe that we got to take out or not take out pick up oh <laughs> we don't need to look for our blood guys we actually we found her awesome that saves me a lot of trouble actually so i'm guessing that this was a vital yes it was right up in the liver and she will give us 532 and now we got to go up there and grab that pronghorn. I think I see the blood trail here. Yup. And is it a vital? It is nice. I knew we got a good hit on him. 
Ooh, ooh, ooh. What the hell was that? Something went running. <gasps> ooh, antelope jackrabbit. 180? Let's see if I can hit him with my new 22. There we go. Oh my god. That was really violent. Holy crap. <laughs> I just did a backflip. I, I really can't get uh, get a hang of this 22 here. It Sometimes it seems like I have to aim way over top of them. And on that time, I really didn't. I, I don't get it. I don't get it at all. Oh, there he is right there. Awesome. And our rabbit should just be up in there. Let's grab him and then hop over there. I think this guy's going to be... Let me take a look. I think he's going to be a silver. Yep, he's a silver. Pretty close to a gold, though. And decent lung shot. Here we go. Hey, little buddy. Oh, my God. Look at the ears on you. God damn. Oh, wow. They're so beautiful. Well, I mean, he's kind of beautiful until you look him in the eyes. That's, <laughs> that's his face only a mother could love. But look at the ears on him. Damn, boy, you're long. Ooh, here we go. I'm about to spawn in right in front of me. And this is for... Bighorn sheep, five of them. Ooh, zero to four. Zero to four in the morning. Okay. Yeah, no, we're not going to do that. But that might mean that they have a nice drink zone around here. I've seen one or two. All right, guys, so we finally got Pablo. Let's reset the time now. I think it was 11, I think is their time to drink. So we'll do 11.42. That should be fine. And I've got something I want to show you guys. <laughs> it's so stupid, but I need to show this to someone. All right. So we've got the uh, the pandemic and the, the forehead. And, you know, my favorite type of TV, Tony. <laughs> so <laughs> I just thought that was really stupid. And I want to share that with you guys. Um, Where's our lake here? It's over here. Yep. So let's come down here and yeah, I'll just take a peek. It should be Bighorn drink time. They should already be there. Hopefully we don't spook anything on the way in. Pablo, where are you, buddy? There you are. Come on, boy. And yeah, hopefully we get something good. All right. What do we have going on around here? Ooh, nope, that's nothing. Come on. Ooh, there we go. Level five. I think... Wait. Yeah, level three. I think it's my first potential diamond... Bighorn. Holy shit. Look at the size of him. It's calm. That's a really good shot. Ooh, do I take it right now? Or do I get a little bit? Oh, he's attentive. Oh, well. Chill, 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 chill. Don't worry about me, buddy. You know what? I guess we're going to use the Empress and we're just going to... We're just going to risk it. Let's let him put his head down and we'll take that shot. All right, here we go. Oh, I think that was a good hit, guys. Man, where are these females, though? We saw there was a bigger group here. I don't know where the females are, though. Maybe, I mean, they might be bedded here, but maybe they don't drink here, which is really strange. Unless they drink up and up on the top of the mountain for some reason, which I've seen that happen before. All right, he should be around here somewhere. Is this his need zone? Oh, guys, there he is. And I think that means we got him with a really good shot. Yup, that's exactly what that means. Holy crap, guys. Look at him. Look at the fucking horns on you, boy. Damn. Those are massive. Oh, okay, let's see. Pablo, get over here, buddy. Moment of truth. Is he a diamond? Yes, he is. There we go. That is my fifth diamond ever. And what a beautiful big horn. 173. Holy shit. And how was the hit? A really nice double lung. Couldn't be better than that. Wow. Guys, I just checked. 170 is really good. They only go up to 180, but guess what? He's also a rare. He's a black fur type, which is apparently rare for these guys. No fucking way. That is awesome. All right, so before we mess up, taxidermy. Do we have enough? Yes, we do. Here we go, guys. Look at him. What a massive massive animal that is probably that might be my favorite diamond that i've gotten so far holy shit look at the curls on you this is our little uh our gold molting was it ring neck pheasant that's <laughs> that's actually really cool 
I didn't know they made that pose. That's awesome. So yeah, if you guys enjoyed today's video, don't forget to drop a like. And if you guys would like to see more videos like this, don't forget to subscribe. Thanks, guys. My name is Rooster, and I'll see you in the next one.